Hello, this is Lucas Palmeira from Imaginando, and I'm here to teach you how to integrate VS Visual Synthesizer with your compositions made on Cubase 12. So let's get right into it. Okay, so we have four tracks here, a kick, a snare, and a hat and a bass. And it sounds something like this. Okay, and now to connect this to VS, the first thing that we're going to do is open and create a group track. Okay, and here on this group track, we have it here. We can go here first to the routing of these channels and they're going to stereo out as we can see. But now if we want to have the audio inside VS, we're going to have to route it to the groups. So we're going to route this all to the group. And here on our group, we're going to go to the inserts and add here our VS. So here it is. Now, what we're going to do next is create MIDI tracks. We're going to duplicate the information of these tracks to send them to VS. So I'm going to add a MIDI track and I'm going to call it Kick VS. And I'm going to copy the information here. Then Snare VS. Same thing. And now I'm going to do it for the other two. it here, copy here, and now I will choose this one and send now the information, the MIDI, into VS. As you can see here, group one, insert one, VS MIDI in, okay, channel one, now the snare, channel two, hi-hat, channel three, and base channel four. So now I can come here on our inserts and open our VS synthesizer and play. And now I'm gonna start programming VS here. So I'm gonna start by making for the kick this cube, this small cube, let me put it smaller and prettier. i put it a little bit smaller, less. Let's trigger it with MIDI. As you can see, it's already playing the kick. Now what I'm going to do is make it rotate it a little bit so it looks better. I'm gonna put it on one fourth, which is the beat. Let's make it the filter sample and hold. I'm gonna do the same here on the second one. Okay, and now I can go here to our modulation page. And make it rotate a little bit. Okay. So we got our kick, now let's put a snare, choose something for the snare, it can be this one, enable, trigger channel 2, and as you can see, it's channel 2 is the snare, and it's being triggered, I'm gonna choose a different
we can do is use the audio which we already routed here as you can hear if I put play you can see here the, uh, the audio routed this audio was routed when I routed here on the mixer when I routed here the audio of these tracks here to the group so the group is receiving the audio and since the um, V VS is an insert here on the group tracks. It's receiving the audio from Cubase. So now I can use something here, for example, to be controlled by the this this audio. So for example, let me try this pattern. Let's enable it. Let me put a softer color, a small brightness and this is the speed this is the pattern let's make the pattern change with the volume probably and see how it goes 
Trigger MIDI No, no Trigger MIDI, I wanna trigger it with audio So, yeah, like this for example and I'll do the pattern, the brightness as well, so I'm gonna put the brightness as zero and here okay, it was already at one, so I'm gonna increase here the pattern at maximum and now the brightness, I'm gonna increase it slowly but I wanna change here the threshold higher so it triggers, I have better control over that brightness No, it's not LFO, sorry, sorry, sorry it's This is what I wanted I can always improve the things but I think it's enough for you guys to have a notion of how things can be done in Cubase and as you can see we have here four MIDI tracks being played and audio being modulated by VS Cubase MIDI notes and audio routed into VS Visual Synthesizer and everything sequenced and this was it guys as you can see it's really easy to integrate uh, VS with your compositions on Cubase you only have to remember to duplicate the MIDI tracks and route the audio to the group where you have the VS on this will this is it for now I will be doing more tutorials and giving you more content. So if you like our content, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. I will be going now. So goodbye.